Hey everyone, welcome back to the Broken Lords Endless Legend playthrough. That got sieged, unfortunately. But, <laughs> uh, it'll be back, and I'm running these guys back home for turn 31. Like I said, I kind of want to see what these two regions are. I'm going to play taller again. I lean, I tour, like, the whole reason to do it with the, um... The Broken Lords is because you can really expand your cities very quickly because you are buying your units. So like here, like I am going to buy another one because it's like, it's just that easy to do it. We're also going to be really great at buyouts, especially when we get to era two and pick this up. Um, it'll be, it'll make us like even better at doing what we do as Broken Lords. Um, I just want to see what the rest of this area has. This place has wine and glass steel, so it's the candidate for expansion. And I want to see what this area provides, and possibly this area. Um, I also have to get these guys pacified, and we're going to do that um, soon. But yeah, I think our cities are just going to be building things. Sounds funny to say it in that way, but it makes sense. Um... I actually forgot to check. Can we fire? We can't fire a booster. Um, I think I'm going to have to send my... Ugh, really? Man, we're getting very, very pillaged this time. Like, we gotta get our guys back, unfortunately, because I have to kill these things off, and I have to do... Like, I could just maybe pull it off killing a two-unit stack with these two, but I don't necessarily want to risk it. Because I'd have to build more dredges to get this quest I have done. So we'll just get our, our little army back home. We'll have a second army soon enough anyways. Can't fire off the emeralds anymore. We're fine. We're still really happy because we went for the um We're still really happy because we went for that uh What do you call it? Sewer system. Now they're just going to be building the museum for me. We got this quest going, and what did we need? Was it 116 going in the city? 116 dust per turn in the city. Um, I think we'll be good on influence. 100, 121 sounds like it's what we need, 120. So, um... That's that. Yeah, it'll take us 17 turns to get our museum, but, uh... Should be fine, ultimately. Because we can make another population there. That's just how it works with us. Oh, good. And someone started that quest up up there. <laughs> um... So yeah, we'll buy the population here and put them there. That'll hurry the library along. And I think we're going to enter Era 2 just right now. Yeah. So I just want to see this. Yeah, 120. That's exactly what we needed. Um... Now, I'm going to pick up, firstly, um, Prisoner, Slaves, and Volunteers. Then we're going to pick up Diplomats, Mance, and then Imperial Highways, Meritocratic Promotion, and Imperial Coinage. And I think we're going to need three more attacks from Era 1 after that. So I'll grab up a Rider, the Topography, oh, and it'll be uh, Mercenary Markets. So we have our quest number two set up. We just need... Um, yeah, that's what we need. It'll take us a little more time um, to get that, but I think we'll be fine on it. So let's see if we can't get up here and kick some ass.
And hopefully we can get the settler in here. I don't really care if the um if the ally beat us to it. Uh Yeah, we're a little behind them. Um I really don't care if they beat us to uh that that region. I'd like that region though, just for the wine. Uh wine is hugely powerful. Okay, dredges are taken care of. Um We have to come over here next. Like we're we're at happy right now on both our cities. Um, we could be fervent with wine. That's why I want wine. Um, and I can buy another population somewhere. Um, they're at six. Let's buy it here. They just haven't converted them yet. So we had to work on that. Like we had to clear this crap out of here first though. Um, do they need to heal? Yeah, they do. Okay. So we will hit and turn. I definitely want that empire plan in before we uh, expand again. Yeah, I know. We have to be big damn heroes with this group here. Um, I'll load up the public library in these places as well. Um, I think we are going to get that empire plan in before that happens. And how's this quest coming? One more turn. Yep, okay, Band of Merriment. Ooh. Yeah. Band of Merriment. We're actually going to grab up that as well. And he's in tier 1, and I think I'll keep him in tier 1 for now, and we'll apply that. Ooh, yeah. So now we can actually uh, move this back on Influence. And we can take uh, these two dredges, new army, and have them explore for us. Yeah, you can't cross that. That's a very narrow sea there. So let's just have them go down here. Um, the Alai haven't taken that place yet. See, I'm not too worried about them either because they're the Alai. They are very, very, like, forced to play tall. You don't expand with Hawaii in general. Oh, we gotta go up here anyways. I find it funny that the minor factions have boats and I don't. Um, let's just buy them. Because we could institute our plan and then expand. It's a risk, though, because there might be a roaming army in there. Oh, shit. Ah! Uh, guess I'm not exploring with those guys. Uh, can I do that? I'm inclined to do that. Um, I don't actually know where I'm going to plonk him down, either. We'll have to actually get there to look. So yeah, let's just, uh... Auto that. Oh, god damn it. Oh, like, we're going to be really weak right now. Broken Lord units, they have really awesome defenses, but... They're actually really weak on the attack. Yeah, let's look at our Fidzy. 
Can't see what's down here, but... That's the problem, is I don't really like the uh, Fidzy output. I think I'm going to put him right here, though. Just to get him on that river. Maybe even right here. Get a little science in there. It all depends. We do need at least three places. I'd like it to be four. Wow. Fifteen titanium. I can spare that. You know, these quest enemies don't do anything, do they? I can't attack them. Eh. Okay, let's have them just get a foot in the door. Right there, maybe. Dorgeshi would be a good second assimilation slot, in my opinion. So, you know what? Um, I could just kill those guys if I wanted to. Let us buy Unit 5 back here. Um, you know, I think I have to kill them next turn. They're just that annoying. 42. Okay, uh, let's see here. Oh, that's terrible. It's all terrible. Three one eight is bad. Just bad. You know? Let's go someplace else. I'm not even joking. I don't need eyeless ones. Um... Yeah, let's just, uh, get the hell out of here and send these guys- but like... But it's wine. <laughs> it would be a bad place to settle, but there's wine. I can't see the Fidzy down here, but um, I'll just assume it's something. We'll build a sea city there. Expand inward. Okay. Get the hell out of my territory. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's so annoying. It really is. No, kill the fucking rumbler. God. I have to come over here and fight the frickin' Dorgeshi now. Um... Or turns. I'm not worried about that. Yeah, we just gotta kill these guys now. 
And that should keep the Dorgashi down. And then, um, yeah, we can worry about other stuff later. Oh, they're just gonna do it for me. Mock into my swords! Okay, I did think of something just now. We are gonna do prisoner, slaves, and volunteers. But we're gonna unassign these four and just learn these two next. And now we're gonna do Diplomats, Mants, and then Imperial Highways, Markets, uh, Meritocratic Promotion. I don't know if I need the Shipyard. I might. Or a Native District. I might need these two. But we're gonna get that done first. Okay, now we can run these guys down here. <laughs> Oh, need two more stalwarts for our city. Okay. Let's see what my fidzy output is. Two, two, nine. Two, six. Seven, three, three. Seven, two, four. Seven, three, five. That might be the best option, honestly, because ten, two. Such a terrible region for us. But it's got wine. <laughs> it's like, we gotta, we gotta get drunk. We gotta get our empire absolutely slammed. Six people. Um. <laughs> Buying the peoples. This is why I like playing them tall, too. I mean, I like playing most of the, uh, the factions tall. I, I know some of them don't do it that well. You know, these guys are relative... Why go, like... Oh, fucking goddamn this game. Okay, so, uh... That, that, and that. I'm going to buy them the sewer system and the mill. Put these guys right here. The mint I can let, um, build up a bit. But we do need to rebuild the eyeless ones, and we'll get the wine going. Oh, I'm gonna buy the wine. Um... And the glass steel can come in. We... Okay, we... There is another village, which is probably down here. Uh, that'll be helpful, actually. Oh, dust filtration. I want that on there, definitely. We want that high on the list. Yeah, that'll be on this list soon. Um... They're just building me stalwarts. Okay, okay. Have to look at. Okay, we need 240. Um, so we need 12 a turn. Probably more than that. A lot more than that. Probably like 16 a turn. Because we're we came up short. Um I think we actually maybe need like 18 a turn. Oh, here's the other great advantage. I mean we'll buy one pop here. One of the great advantages of the Broken Lords is you can buy your population, which means when you settle a new city, you can just immediately populate it. Yeah, so let's get these guys in here, and I want to see what this area is about, and see if we can't loop up there. Um... So this place's population can be instantly increased, and we're just going to do it a couple times here. Shift some stuff over to gold. Um, we do need more influence, I think, coming in, unfortunately. And we get our we get our museum next turn, though. Excellent. Mm.
Dust Filtration. I want to import the library, and I'll let the library go. It's only going to take four turns, or six turns to get it in. No, let's get that pearl. Um, yeah, massive trees are awesome when you're not the Broken Lords. I also, like, I see Prisoner, Slaves, and Volunteers as four turns off, which is why I have to kind of hold off on buying things. That's not connected. Ooh. This is intriguing now. Um, that might be an island. A lot of times, islands are good, like, places to settle. If you can get your ships. If you can get shipbuilding done. Because, um... You, uh... You can use them sort of as a backup in case you fail horribly at the game. Yeah, unfortunately, we don't have wine coming in uh, because of the effects of winter. Kind of bullshit. We could put a Broken Lord's Hero in there eventually because we can buy him. Um, I might just buy him now. Because if you look, Broken Lord's Heroes have the Mining Authority. That's plus one resource on deposit. So um, I could buy this guy and slip him into our other city. In fact, let's buy him and slip him into our other city. Uh, I could slip them in here. Unfortunately, it's a really terrible place to put them. Luckily, we can give them that. And that. And he will eventually be able to get us our wine even during the winter at 1. And he'll get it in the summer at 2. So, uh, That'll be enough to sustain us, at least in... Um... The summer. But I'd like to figure out... I'd like to be able to pull off getting more of it in. Because I'm not going to have... Like, I might as well just raz this city to the ground if I can't get the wine going. Because the whole reason I pick that up. Makes me wish I had two more pearls, because then I'd just go for the altar. Actually, um, New Army. Let's send these guys down here. Because this city is going to have nothing to do for a while. Um, and I actually want to start burrowing this place immediately. So, uh... We want to surround the altar, so that's going to be there, and we're going to put one right there. Oh, wait, we're not doing a triangle, are we? No, I think we got to do a triangle. I'd love to be able to pull up. I'd love to be able to expand into here, but there are temple ruins right there, because we got this. We got moss pearls, which is awesome. Actually, wait, cancel that burrow. We are going to expand on there. We're just going to have a chunk missing. So what we're going to do is we're going to expand here, here and here and then we're gonna just expand around here um it's gonna be a janky city it's gonna be an unhappy city but luckily we have that awesome ass ring that gives happiness so <laughs> i think we'll be fine on happiness in all honesty And that was turn 50, so I think I'm going to end that episode right there. So, thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you're enjoying this Broken Lords playthrough. Um, we'll see what happens next time. We got some diplomacy happening, it looks like. But I'll, I'll look at that next time. So, thanks for watching, everyone. And I'll see you guys then.